Hello everyone. Welcome to the YouTube channel Math1089. Number Patterns Yes, the title of the current video is Number Pattern 2. The link for the first number pattern video and the second number pattern video is given in the description box. In this video, we will discuss about the third number pattern and the number pattern is given on the screen. In ancient India, mathematician Mahaviracharya, Mahaviracharya studied these type of products in his book. Now, few observations regarding this number pattern. Left hand side of this number pattern consists of only ones and all the terms in the left hand side are the product of two numbers. For example, if we consider the first row, it's the product of 1 and 1. Second row, it's 11 into 11. Third row, 111 into 111. As we move down, as we move down, the number of ones is increasing. Now to the right hand side, the first term is 1 because 1 into 1 is 1 but 11 into 11 is 121 basically it is a palindrome actually if we reverse this number once again we will get 121 similarly 111 into 111 is 12321 now 111 into 111 is equal to 1, 2, 3, 2, 1. How many 1 is there? 3. How many 1 is here? Also 3. So basically, these two terms are identical. So this similarity, that means this number 3 will appearing here at the middle and to the right side, it will goes on decreasing. To the left side also it goes on decreasing. What I mean to say the middle number is 3, next number in decreasing order is 2, next to that is 1, same for the left side. This pattern actually continues till the last. Now let's analyze how this pattern actually works. Moreover, this pattern works up to nine ones. If we see how many ones are there in the last row, it is nine ones. What will going to happen if there will be 10 ones or 11 or 12 ones, something like that, definitely it won't work. Here, every step depend on the previous step. For example, 1 into 1, sorry, 1 into 1 is 1, that is well known. Now, if we consider 11 into 11 equal to 121, it's a very simple calculation. Moreover, we all know that 11 square is 121. If we take this result, then it becomes very easy to find the value of 111 into 111 and we can check that this value is 1, 2, 3, 2, 1. Let's see how. Now, 111 into 111 equal to 111 square. And that is same as 111 square minus 11 square plus 11 square. That means we can subtract this number and we can add this number. Now if we apply the formula of a square minus b square to this first two term, it will be a plus b into a minus b. So 111 plus 11 into 111 minus 11. And these two term is in the product form. Plus 11 square is 1 to 1 we are taking help from the previous step. 
111 plus 11 is 122 into 111 minus 11 is equal to 100 plus 121. If we multiply 122 into 100, definitely this is equal to 12200. Now, we can directly add 121, but we will not add it directly. Let us write 120 like 100 plus 20 plus 1. And let's add all the number. Definitely this will be 1, this will be 2, this will be 3, this will be 2, this will be 1. So this number is 1, 2, 3, 2, 1 as expected. Let's see how the next row of number following the same rule. So this rule is applicable for these numbers. It's fine. Now let's show how this actually helps us to find the value of 4 ones into 4 1 equal to 1 2 3 4 3 2 1. By the previous step, what we have in our hand is 111 into 111 is equal to 1 2 3 2 1. With the help of this, let us find the value of 4 ones that is 1111 into 1111 that is equal to 1111 square and we will subtract 111 square and add 111 square so that the entire expression remains same. Why? Three ones that is 111 square because there is 4 1 there is 4 1 so the number of ones we will take 1 less than 4 that is 3 now if we apply a square minus b square formula to the first number it is equal to 1111 plus 111 into 1111 minus 111 plus 111 square. The value for the first term is 1222. Second one is 1000. Third one is 1, 2, 3. 1 that is 12,321 and it is taken from the previous step. Definitely this is equal to 1, 2, 2, 2 followed by 3, 0 plus 1, 2, 3, 2, 1. Now we can add them directly but here the way we will add them is like this 1 3 2 triple 0 then 1 2 3 2 1 that means 1 followed by 4 0 so just write 1 followed by 4 0 then 2 followed by 3 0 then 3 followed by 3 0 then 2 followed by single 0, finally 1. If we add all these numbers, the value is 1, 2, 3, 2, 1. Now, once we add all the terms, once we add all the term, it is simply 1, 2, 3, 4, 3, 2, 1 as expected. So this is the way how actually the logic follows in this particular pattern. There is one more thing to observe 
in this particular pattern. Now we have seen 11 into 11 is equal to 1 to 1, 121. Now consider the middle number that is 2 and if we write 22 into 22 that means we will take as many twos as there are ones in both the number in the left hand side and whole divided by the sum of the digits in this number that is 1 plus 2 plus 1. How this work? That is the big question. How actually this works? So we can have a discussion like this 22 into 22 by 1 plus 2 plus 1 we can write 22 like 2 into 11 and another 22 like 2 into 11. So 2 into 11 for the first 22, 2 into 11 for the second 22 and multiplication symbol in between them. 1 plus 2 plus 1 is equal to 4. 1 plus 2 plus 1 is equal to 4. 4 means 2 into 2. So this is the expression given. So cancel first 2 with this 2, second 2 with this 2 and automatically this is same as 11 into 11. Now if we consider the next number then 111 into 111. is equal to 1, 2, 3, 2, 1. We can see 3 is at the middle. How many ones are there in the left hand side? 3. Here also 3. So simply we can write it like this. 333 into 333 whole divided by 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1. That means sum of all the digits in this particular number. Sum of all the digits in this particular number. Let's see whether this is equal or not. Now 333 into 333 whole divided by 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1 is equal to 3 into 111 and this is also 111 into 3. So this is the numerator and denominator is 9. 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1 is equal to 9 and 9 is same as 3 into 3. As before we can cancel the first 3 with this 3 second 3 with this 3 and 111 into 111 is remaining. Definitely this is what we are expecting. Thank you for watching this video. Hope you enjoy this video. Please subscribe to our channel Math1089 and share this video. Thank you once again.